Hey guys, Clumsy here, and welcome to a brand new game called Chromagun. The developers over at Pixel Maniacs emailed me and sent me a copy, and was thinking if I would be interested to try it out, and for sure I am, and that's why we're here. Now, Chromagun is a puzzle type game that works with colors, and I guess it makes more sense to just play, start playing it to see what it's all about, right? I also haven't tried it out so much yet except for the very basics just to check some sounds and everything right so let's get started welcome to chromatech and let me know if there's any funky sound levels but uh, let's see we'll see in a bit so we're just in this elevator over here and now we've arrived welcome to the chromatech test lab you're here because you're the best of the best. Not because you were in need of 10 bucks and nobody else signed up. I mean, who would have given you that idea? Before we start, we need to test your general mobility. Make your way down the corridor towards the exit door. Note that the exit is the part of the wall that looks different from the other parts of the wall. Also, it says exit. Okay. All right, let's follow that. These are the drones, I think, that would play a huge part in this game. So the puzzles look really interesting from what I've seen. They're very basic in the beginning, but they seem like they can become very complicated once the game really starts. This is more like the tutorial. Please pick up the semi-automatic nano-acrylic projectile firearm right in front of you. This guy. This is the Chromagon Pack uh -huh. Landing! Paint the worker drawer to move it out of the way. Then exit mm. the room using the room exiting technique you've learned in the previous room. All right, there we go. So shooting that guy moved it to the right. Shooting this guy, it seems they're attracted to whichever wall is colored the same way as they are. So in this, this guy is already yellow. So even if we shoot it, it won't budge. But if we shoot something on the wall, so these ones with the, what is this, a hexagon. Hexagon type texture won't be colored, but these guys will. Eh, voila. Alright, so now if we shoot this guy, and then we shoot, there should be one here, like there. Yep, perfect. Okay. That's good. I have increased the volume quite a bit. Sensational. Please walk towards the exit again. We're confident you've acquired all the necessary skills to complete this simple exercise. I'm not sure if that's too much, but let me know, right? So this guy, we need to get out of here. And if we can shoot that guy and shoot that wall, interesting. So it sorts of balances out between the different colored walls and moves accordingly. Okay. If we shoot that wall, all right. That's easy enough. And this guy, yep. That's cool. The paint the chroma gun fires is a specially developed blend of partially semi-lethal, dangerously radioactive isotopes, and will paint any surface not designed not to be painted by it. That being said, please do not sniff, touch, or especially lick the paint. Okay. That's interesting. So these, yeah, these guys we can color, but the ones here we can't. Right, that makes it a more controlled environment, I would guess. All right, get out of the way, please. And you, what is this? Hmm. Okay. If we color you, can you go here? Or there, here, here. 
Okay, that's good. And then this guy, can you go here? No? Oh. How? Okay, he moved there for some reason. Alright. Alright, that's good enough. This is simple enough. Now, what would be exciting is once the other colors come in, and Please we would need to subsequently combine the trigger, and we would need to combine different colors. Sensational! Please do not leave the trigger to ensure the continued opening of the exit door. Sensational! <laughs> there we go. Okay, so we can have drones stand on those spots to leave the doors open. Sensational! You have successfully understood the correlation between triggers and worker droids. Yep. That makes you more intelligent than 39% of test subjects and 97% of test monkeys. Okay, cool. Yep, looks simple enough. What is this? Nothing. Fire exit. The attraction that Chroma Gun's paint generates is based on a very complex set of mathematical vector operations. So instead of not understanding me explaining it to you, <laughs> try it out now. <laughs> Alright, so what that means is we can do like this and color this and with, we'll do some mathematical equations to go right in the middle of those colored walls like that. Same here. If we tap that and these two to get magnetized to the middle sounds simple enough all right so far so good how's everyone doing okay what is this now all right this is a bit more complicated i guess i guess we have to go balance it out right there there we go in the middle puzzle games are something i enjoy it is worth noting that unlike the ones you've encountered in the previous rooms, the worker droids in this next room are not deactivated, but hibernating. Much like you and me, they do not take kindly to being shot at with paint pellets. Please do not disturb them, because even though they're not designed to kill you upon contact, due to miscommunication and engineering, they will. Okay, this adds a bit of twist into it. Now, puzzle games, I enjoy playing them, but I haven't really tried recording them. So this is kind of new to me as well. Wait a minute. So are these the hibernated guys? I think that's the one, that the one sleeping there. And I think we shouldn't touch that. So they won't get mad. Okay. <gasps> no, 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 just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> Alright, so there are guys who will follow us. Now, just for the sake of science, what happens when it attaches to us? Okay. Do we die from that? I don't know. Can you hit this? No? Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, we die. Remember, if you want helpful worker droids to aid you with the completion of this chamber, these aren't the worker droids you are looking for. <laughs> it is worth noting that unlike the ones you've encountered in the previous rooms, the worker droids in this next room are not deactivated, but hibernating. Much like you and me, they do not take kindly to being shot at with paint pellets. Please do not disturb them. Okay, we did that before, but that's good. So that's simply a drone which follows you around, but still sticks to walls. The Depending on the color, can be mixed on canvas. If you remember your time in kindergarten, that part should be easy. Oh no! If yeah. you don't remember, or you never actually went to kindergarten, you may attend the Chromatech seminar on subtractive color mixing for preschoolers at the end of the test. So wait a minute, <laughs> I kind of forgot about this. So this guy is a bit orange or reddish. If we shoot it, it will become orange, light orange. I assume. There we go. Okay, this is where it gets interesting. So, how do we do this now with only a yellow gun? I shoot you, you go there. That's good. I shoot... Blue plus yellow is green. 
perfect and then what is this why aren't you going there it's broken I shoot you nothing all right and this one how do I make you go there okay if I shoot this wall then it won't be attracted this drone won't be attracted here and it will go to the left perfect and that's brown interesting violet plus yellow is brown so if I shoot this guy nothing all right fine maybe that's for a next uh, next something next step okay someone's sleeping over there can I color you yellow thank you can I shoot you no all right anyway so I'm still not sure how to determine if a drone will follow us or not it must look quite different yeah these puzzles are simple enough very basic this one's a sim the same mechanic shoot this wall to attach it to the other side interesting this one too okay and this one we have this guy again which I'm not sure what it's for all right now we do have this lower left icons here and I guess to continue the test nice please acquire the upgraded tricolored chroma gun perfect As without it you would not be able to solve the subsequent rooms and eventually succumb to hunger perfect now we have three colors which I would not all oh, right primary colors I was thinking RGB but RGB was for computers right which I'm not sure why why didn't they didn't just stick with uh, primary colors must be something with a screen but anyway all right so this is red I color you red simple enough and this is blue I assume yep there we go now it's open awesome this is a very relaxing game and uh, provides a good exercise for, for the brain without giving us a heart attack. You know what I mean? Okay, this is closed. This is closed. This guy is... Okay, we need to color it orange. Now, how do we color it orange? Red and yellow, if I remember correctly. Red and yellow. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> So apparently I went to kindergarten just right Now how do we do this? I color the wall Blue plus red is violet. I think oh, I can't color them But I can color them like this Crap, oh no, how do I remove it? <laughs> okay, I think we have another chance here um I think you can do it like this and then blue. There we go. Phew. All right, we're safe. Next up, we would need to color it green. Color you green. So blue first and then yellow. There we go. That was easy enough. All right, now it's get it's getting a bit interesting. Um, how do I color that? So if I color you blue and red, right? There we go. Okay, that's one. This guy is green, so let's color it like that. Perfect. And one more. This guy needs to be orange, so we just need... I don't know, yellow? <gasps> it's the mad type. Come on, get attracted to it. Alright, thank you. Nice. So these guys, what do I need you for? Nothing. But I guess they're the angry ones. I won't touch them though, if I don't need to. Might be a bit scary. All right, let's see. Okay, this one's a bit protected. 
need to push it over here so we need a red and actually is that red yeah it's red yellow okay it's chasing me now so it didn't change color but it did start chasing me which is okay there we go all right that's nice oh man the angry mob so they can't go through here can they can i i can't as well all right so we can i guess shoot through them still uh we need one blue one blue there we go so this area here this rainy part we can have projectiles come through we need green we need purple and we need orange like a pro all right <laughs> now where are we going Ooh. this looks kind of scary hey we've been here before same here okay maybe on this other side all right so we need to have this colored up to be brown i guess no there we go can you go here oh no oh no 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 what's happening why aren't you attracted to that okay that's not cool wait a minute wait a minute <laughs> help okay let's have everybody chase me and maybe we can have this like a, a train that someone will eventually go through here no <laughs> i don't know how this works there must be a more systematic way to do this oh, crap. okay so i think i got it i think there should be another way for this so the brown ones don't really follow the brown cells the brown drones don't follow the brown walls instead i think i can have this guy follow me like so and go here and get magnetized to this red spot here there we go that's the way awesome okay cool let's do maybe one last before we end this video i'm really enjoying this so far yellow orange a green and purple that was easy enough what is this we would need to color you red here okay and then i don't know color it red again here what's this for i'm not sure ah okay so we pass through here first th step we pass through here and then we color that a different color so it opens that other one instead and opens this door in the process cool now what now we have access uh, oh it's our guy again it's our it's this guy's turn again come here <laughs> this guy's the mvp for this stage come on you can do it come on all right just a bit more um you need to go here buddy so uh, let me color that differently thank you and we made it all right guys that's going to be it for this video i think i've enjoyed this game actually yeah it, it reminds me it's a good refresher for the different color combinations and provides a good bit of bit of puzzles i'm expecting that the puzzles will get a lot harder as we go along but in the meantime that's going to be it i might be playing this offline instead but if you're interested in seeing more episodes do let me know in the comments and hit the like button all right to let me know that you are interested in seeing more in the meantime that's going to be it guys this is the clumsy geek signing off 
Thanks for watching and have a nice day. Bye bye.